Hello, in this video I'm gonna show you how to try to fix Wi-Fi problems on Samsung Galaxy A25 5G. So first of all, we're gonna open settings, let's go to connections, and let's open Wi-Fi. So the first thing that you can do is simply turn off and on Wi-Fi in order to refresh the Wi-Fi feature. If that doesn't help, what you can also do is if you have your Wi-Fi network um, available in current network, if you have been connected to the network before, uh, you can press the disk gear icon on the right side in order to open the settings and you want to forget the uh, network and then try to connect again. If you cannot find the network in current network, then you may need to go to the top right corner and tap on these three dots. And then you want to go to advanced settings, then choose manage networks and over here you will find your network. So you can press delete over here at the bottom select the network that you want to forget, so remove the desired connected uh, network and choose to delete. Simple as that. And after that, try to once again find it in available networks and connect to it. If the issue still exists, then the next thing that you need to do is of course make sure that the airplay mode is not enabled. Sometimes we can turn on the airplay mode by accident and this can of course cause some issues with Wi-Fi not working properly even if the Wi-Fi is on. Besides that, there is one more thing that we can do. So let's go back to the settings, scroll all the way down and let's go to general management. Now over here we need to go to reset and then here we will find reset Wi-Fi and Bluetooth settings. You want to select this option and just like the name suggests, we will restore default settings for Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Unfortunately, we cannot really separate those two. So if you have any Bluetooth devices connected to your uh, smartphone, then you will need to reconnect again. And of course, the same goes with Wi-Fi. So every change that you made in the settings that can cause some issues um, will be uh, fixed and restored to default. So press this button and go through the reset. And of course, after that, you want to go back to the Wi-Fi settings in order to connect, to try to connect your Wi-Fi again. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye!